nurses around the world, their scrubs have become their suits of armor, helping them bravely fight a war against an invisible enemy. Jessica Mock wears her armor proudly as an ICU nurse at a Brooklyn hospital in the epicenter of the COVID-19 crisis. We became a COVID positive ICU unit. So we became critical care nurses and now all my patients were sedated, intubated. Jess is unfortunately no stranger to loss. Back in high school, I actually lost my niece, Diana. She was the most bubbly little girl. She was perfect. She had something underdeveloped in her brain and that caused her to have a seizure and we lost her very early. It didn't take long for Jess to turn a tragedy into a positive and embrace her desire to help others. She is why I do what I do. But over the last few months, she's remembered how much of a toll loss can take. I felt like I was seeing more loss than wins, and it was very defeating. Then something changed. He was on a ventilator, a perfectly healthy man. His fever was very high, so I was just praying if I could just break it. Jess could see the fight in that patient. I've prayed, give strength to my patients to keep on fighting for their lives. And his will to live became her strength. Within weeks, he actually started controlling his breathing. He wasn't breathing over the vent. Then a couple more days after that, he was responsive. Now that's a huge win. That was my biggest win. Among the pain and sorrow of a hospital ICU unit came a glimmer of hope. My anxiety and fear of this whole pandemic, he changed it to hope. It's that story of survival that keeps Jess suiting up every day. Her message now to other nurses is the same as it is for her patients. We are fighting this together. So whether we're in a different hospital, a different state, my win is your win. Um, we're just saving people and we're getting through this. So for Jessica and nurses everywhere, no matter how many wins or losses, it's your dedication, compassion, and the hope you have for your patients. We are getting through this. On Staten Island, Jessica East Hope, Currents News. If you're watching Currents News on YouTube, be sure to hit the subscribe button and then click on the bell to get instant updates about all of our newest content because we are putting your faith in the news.